Hello everybody, today we will see how to copy data from Azure Blob Storage to GCS using GCS Fuse. This is the Azure uh, storage account which I have created for the demonstration purpose. So this can be accessed via this primary endpoint. So let's go into this Blobs service. And I have created a container called GCS Bucket where I have uploaded a file named temp.mp4 and the type is block blob and it is around 130 MB. So the access key details, you can get that by clicking on access keys here. I'll use the primary access key. To copy the data, first we need to install this Azure copy, a utility to copy from blob storage. So let's copy this line and install the stuff in our micro VM. And this also requires async. Let me install that. And you will get this warning because it's uh, ephemeral uh, VM. So just ignore that. Uh, and the, need, the main reason for using this uh, ephemeral VM is we just don't want to create a VM just to transfer it. But if it's in a production, uh, it's recommended to do it via a compute engine. So that's done. Uh, let's run this. Install. So it's all done. The Azure copy is installed. So you see that. Installation is completed. So the next step is to install uh, GCS Fuse. So if we go here, we'll see the steps how to install it. And the, the OS recommended is Linux and uh, OS X. So if we scroll, we'll see the steps to install it. So this is the place where we can get the installation steps. So let's copy these lines. So we should be able to do, let's copy get. The same warning, so. It's done, let's install GCS Fuse. After successful installation of uh, GCS Fuse, the com next command is to mount it. Uh, so you need to use this GCS Fuse, GCS bucket name, and a folder in this uh, ephemeral VM. So this is the command. So let's hit enter. So we get this uh, permission denied. Uh, so what we can do is use sudo. So it's successfully mounted now. The next command is we need to copy it from Azure Blob Storage to GCS uh, Storage. So let's copy this command. So it's sudo Azure copy. The source is this one, the one which we saw in the beginning. GCS bucket temp.mp4. Destination is the folder which we mounted. And the key is there. And I have made it uh, verbose to see uh, more uh, interactively. So transfer is happening. We 
will also refresh the screen to see what's happening. So you see it's zero bytes, so the data is getting transferred. And if we see it's completed and it's completed in 28 seconds. And let's refresh it again. So the same file which we saw around 130 MB is been transferred. So it's a very simple command. Uh, that's it for now. Thanks a lot for watching.